So here we go, section three five, by far, by far the shortest of all the sections. Okay, one of the ideas here, they want us to use compasses, and I don't know, I don't know if it makes sense for us to use and share compasses, so we'll probably skip that part. I don't think you're gonna get burned by not have, having to use a compass. Um, I just don't think you will. You're never gonna have to use it on, a, on any kind of test of any kind, so. Using properties of parallel lines. Again, this one says theorem 3.11. I'm not going to write that down. I'm not going to write it down because it means nothing. What I am going to write is if two lines are parallel to the same line, then they are parallel to each other. Okay, now this is kind of like a common sense type of thing. Okay, um, if two lines are parallel to the same line, then they are parallel to each other. It's kind of like the transitive property, but don't put transitive for this because I'm going to mark it wrong. But it's similar to transitive because in transitive, if you have two things that are equal to the same thing, then they're equal to each other. Here we're saying if two lines are parallel to the same line, then the two lines are parallel to each other, okay? So it means that if I had this, and I said that was A, and I said that was B, and I said that was C, and if they told me that A was parallel to B, but then they said, oh yeah, but we know that B is parallel to C. So if these two are parallel, and these two are parallel, then we can say that, sometimes you'll see this, this means therefore, A is parallel to C. Okay, so if two lines are parallel to each other, okay, or two lines are parallel to the same line, then they're parallel to each other. That's what that means. That's what that means. Now, I want you to think of an example where we have parallel lines like that. A real life example where we have one line and it's parallel to this line and it's parallel to this line and then there may be another line that's parallel. I want you to think of some real life objects or things where this comes into play. Okay, think about that for a second. I'm going to give you some. Okay, one of them is a ladder. Okay, if you think of a ladder, okay, the way the ladder is constructed, each of those rungs of the ladder has to be parallel. If they're not, we're, you're going to have some real trouble there. You're going to have people that get injured. Okay, another one. Stairs. Okay, when they go up, they're not taking that top stair and making sure it's parallel to the bottom stair. They're going from one stair, the first stair to the second stair. And then they go from the second stair to the third stair. They're not trying to compare the third stair with the first stair. Okay. They're using this property. That's how this is used. Okay. Another one, a football field. Okay. If you create a football field and they have all these lines that marks the, the yards, all of those are parallel. Okay, um, a bookshelf. Someone creates a bookshelf and you've got these, you know, these different rows in the bookshelf. That's another example of this in real life. If, you, if you're in class and you look at the floor, all the squ squares in the floor, all those lines are parallel if you look at that. Okay, so those are all different examples of that particular property in real life. Now there's one other one that we're going to look at and it says, in a plane, if two lines are perpendicular to the same line, then they are parallel to each other. So if I have a line like that and a line like that and a line cuts through and this is perpendicular and this is perpendicular, then we know the lines are parallel. Okay. Um, we also would know that by corresponding angles. There's, sometimes you can have more than one answer for these. Okay. But that's, that's how that works. Okay. That's how that works. And in essence, that is section. 3.5. Like I said, pretty quick, pretty easy. Okay. I'm sure that you guys didn't have any problems with that. Um, if you do, please send me an email. All right.